Hi Lisa, I've got your uh, machine up on the bench. I've removed the ribbon lift assembly just so we can get a look at why that hammer is not firing. And it looks like it's the clutch that has gone on this thing. So I'm going to try and show you here. It's a little hard, this keyboard doesn't have a long cable on it. So there we go. Now if we type you see it's not firing. And I'll try and show you. The clutch isn't releasing. I don't know if you can see that. So I'm going to manually... Right here, there's a catch. And what I'll do is I'm going to manually release that. Now she'll fire. I've moved that up, but it doesn't return, so the clutch is, is kind of gone. I thought it might be the motor, but the motor's spinning, spinning fine. I'll try and show you that. It's going to be, I don't know if you'll be able to see it on the camera. But right down there, so the motor's spinning, but it, the clutch isn't engaging, so it's just spinning. Now, now it'll fire because I've moved it. So the sound you were hearing was the was the motor spinning and not engaging with that gear, kind of rubbing against it. So I'll give you a call. There's not too much we can do with that. This this assembly, this clutch assembly, something's wrong with it. And it it's not really a part that's readily available. <laughs> okay. Anyway, I'll give you a call and I'll find out uh, what you want to do. Okay, I'll talk to you in a little bit. Bye.